Local this evening, students at NWTC are trying to solve what the CDC calls a growing crisis. As Chris Shula reports, they're taking part in the Tiny Earth Project, a worldwide effort to develop new life-saving antibiotics. For five months, microbiology students like Bradley Ravey have been digging up soil across northeast Wisconsin, searching for new bacteria which leads to new antibiotics. There's so many bacteria that we have yet to even discover. Ravey and his classmates are taking part in the Tiny Earth Program, where students in 45 states and 15 countries work together to solve the global health challenge of a diminishing supply of effective antibiotics. We are running out of antibiotics. We're on our last generation of antibiotics, and the last new antibiotics were introduced 20 years ago. If we don't find new antibiotics that work against these bacteria are, that are evolving resistance, yeah. uh, Simple things like scratches can kill a person. According to the CDC, more than 2.8 million antibiotic resistant infections occur in the U.S. each year and more than 35,000 people die as a result. But Dr. Cole Akethis says a solution may come from unearthing new antibiotic producing microbes in the soil. Right under our feet, there's probably 100 million different types of bacteria that we still have no idea what they are. His students took samples near shopping malls, waterways, even Chick-fil-A, and sent results to a database at UW-Madison, and a few show great promise. So far, three seem to be brand new bacteria. And perhaps one will lead to a new antibiotic, discovered by students digging in the dirt. Reporting in Green Bay, Chris Schuler, Local 5 News. Thank you, Chris. 14 colleges and universities in Wisconsin are taking part in the Tiny Earth Program.